Hi guys, welcome back for another video. So we are going to be decorating my January monthly and I have this numbers sticker book from Carpe Diem that I found on Amazon and I'm super excited with how many colors and shapes of numbers are in here because my planner this year is a undated planner for both the monthly and the weeklies. So I'm going to be using the sticker book to date my monthlies and doing a bit of decorating. So I'm going to pull these pages out just to make decorating easier and I think I'm going to go for kind of like a blue winter theme. So I'm trying to decide which ones I'm going to use and I think I'm going to use these smaller circle stickers for this month and I'm just going to go ahead and date the entire month of January. So now that I have my month dated, it is time to decorate. And I think I'm gonna go through these books right here. And I think I'm gonna go for a hot chocolate winter theme for my monthly. And I'm trying to decide if I wanna use this and a happy new year sticker, but I think I actually wanna save that for the weekly page. So I'm going to flip through here and see what kind of hot chocolate stickers that I have to work with and I think I'm going to stick to mostly decorating the sidebar because I want to get better at using my monthly layouts a little bit more productively than I usually do. So I want to make sure that because I'm not 100% sure how exactly I'm going to plan in the boxes, I want to leave myself quite a bit of space to plan. So I love these little hot chocolate mugs. So I'm gonna grab three and layer these a little bit and place those right below this box sticker. So I'm being decorative and also using these empty box stickers so I still have a place to write in the sidebar. I love these snowflakes, so I think I'm going to place these up here in this open spot above the days of the week. And then I'm just going to use my ruler and draw a line from each of these, just so they're like hanging from the top of the page. I'm looking forward to doing a little bit more of kind of a functional planning system this year. And even though I'm still gonna be using stickers, I'm still gonna be decorating, I want to make sure that my planner is actually working for me instead of just decorating it and then finding that I don't really have the space to plan what I need to plan. So my boxes, like I said earlier, are going to remain pretty empty. I just have the number stickers. And then as we move through the year and I get more used to exactly how I wanna use my monthly, I might get a little bit more decorative in those boxes. So now I'm just going to decorate this bottom corner here and I'm trying to find a sticker to layer over that box sticker. Mm -hmm. 
And then I want to do the same thing with a couple more of these hot chocolate mugs. And I might place these down here, but I want to do a little bit of decoration on the other page. So I'm going to place these in the bottom corner just so that I have hot chocolate mugs on this page. So it kind of brings the design to the other side as well. And I don't like this sticker here. The colors don't match really well, so I'm going to peel that up. And the paper in this planner doesn't really like to have the stickers peeled up that much, but that's okay because I'm going to cover it with another sticker. So I'm going to use this one because it has the blues and pinks from the other sections of this layout. And I just love this girl ice skating. I think it's so cute. And then my planner this year that I am using is one that I found from Park Lane at Joanne and I love it because the dashboard pages with the tabs for the monthlies are just dividers which is exactly what I've been looking for. So there is my completed January monthly. I love how wintry this is and it's a good reminder to make a bunch of hot chocolate for the winter and I cannot wait to plan inside of this planner and just kind of try some things out. So be sure to hit that thumbs up button if you enjoyed this plan with me and hit that subscribe button and I will talk to you all in tomorrow's video. Bye guys!